I, I know that my liberal... Once political rivals, now fellow liberals, as a bright green light turns red. The color of my team uh, does not compromise who I am or what I will continue to do for this riding. The green hope was that Jenica Atwin's breakthrough in Fredericton would be the start of something bigger in Atlantic Canada, building on provincial success in New Brunswick and PEI. She joined Elizabeth May and Paul Manley to give the Greens a caucus of three. That's now down to two. Um, again, I never expected this day to come. It came in part because of internal Green Party disagreement over Israel. When party leader Anami Paul called for a de-escalation of violence between Israel and Hamas, Atwin tweeted the statement was inadequate and wrote, I stand with Palestine. One of Paul's advisors, Noah Zatzman, responded on Facebook, accusing Atwin of appalling anti-Semitism, vowing, we will work to defeat you. It's been really difficult to focus on the important work that needs to be done on behalf of my constituents, um, so it certainly has played a role. I have never had anything but incredibly positive things to say about her. I was looking forward to campaigning for her in the next election. Paul says she was surprised by the move, doesn't agree with it, but claims Atwin's conversations with the Liberals predate the controversy over Israel. None of those uh, reasons touched upon me, and her decision uh, predated, uh, not her decision, but her approach to the Liberals um, pre, uh, uh, well predated uh, the events um, uh, that you mentioned. But Paul's own MP seemed to corroborate Atwin's version of events. Paul Manley and Elizabeth May issued a statement saying they are heartbroken at the loss of their dear colleague and blaming their own leader's advisor for causing this crisis. David Cochran, CBC News, Ottawa.